Welcome to another episode of Blonde in the Kitchen. Today I will be sharing with you how to peel and cut a pomegranate. When picking a pomegranate, look for one that has deep ruby red skin. A third of the way down from the top of the fruit, I'm going to cut through the skin to make a cap. Here I'm cutting all the way around. Try not to cut too deep to avoid cutting through the pomegranate seeds. Using your fingers or a knife, go around the cut that you've made and start gently pulling the skin away from the seeds. We're releasing tension here, so take your time while doing this step so that most of your seeds will stay intact. Now that the tension has been released, start pulling the cap up gently all the way around the cut until it comes off and the first step is complete. As you start to pull off the cap, some loose seeds might fall, so it's always good to have a plate or a bowl handy. And you've completed the first step to opening up your pomegranate. Now using your knife, pierce through to the center of your fruit so that we can release this middle piece. Using the membrane as a guide, we're going to make vertical cuts down the sides of the pomegranate. Repeat this step all the way around the fruit, and this is going to give us our nice big pieces. Now that we have cuts all around the pomegranate, start to break apart the pieces from one another, and you'll notice the membrane is left in the middle of the fruit. Pull it out, and don't let any of those seeds go to waste. I grew up hearing many stories about pomegranate and how powerful it could be. My great-grandfather had pomegranate trees in his garden, and he would give the juice of the pomegranate to my mom to cure her childhood anemia. All we have left to do now is clean each individual piece and collect all of the seeds. Break the pieces away from the core, and here it's good to have an extra plate or two to collect the skins and the loose seeds. You'll notice here that I'm removing the skin from each individual piece. Once I'm done with that, I'll remove the membrane, and you're left with a nice clean piece of pomegranate. Check the skins for loose seeds and collect them in a bowl. You can sun dry the leftover skins and use them as a powder in your skincare routine. I hope this video was helpful, and I want to thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe if you've enjoyed and if you'd like to be notified of future videos. Yours truly, Blonde in the Kitchen.